following message is transmitted at the request of the United States Centers for Disease Control. A virus of unknown origin has been released in the Northern Hemisphere and is currently responsible for making more than 3 million people sick with fever and vomiting in the United States in the last six hours. Large population centers have the largest number and percentage of sicknesses. Details are currently unknown, but airborne transmission is assumed to be responsible for the rapid spread of the virus. Those in unaffected areas should take shelter inside and try to seal off all points where outside air can enter the building. Those who are unaffected should avoid contact with anybody who is currently sick. This message is being transmitted on all stations and will be updated when new information is available. contagious and fatal virus released in the northern hemisphere is responsible for 7 million deaths and another 50 million sick in the United States. The virus has been identified as an H6N9 variant of the influenza virus. Anybody displaying symptoms of fever and vomiting and anybody who has been around them within six hours should be isolated and avoided at all costs. H6N9 is highly contagious and fatal. All people in the United States should immediately fill bathtubs, toilets, sinks, water jugs, and other containers with drinking water. All water should be boiled before drinking. Emergency food supplies should be stored and protected. This message is being transmitted on all stations and will be updated when new information is available. H6N9 virus released in the Northern Hemisphere has killed an unknown number of people in the United States. Estimates range as high as 30 million deaths and another 200 million sick. H6N9 has displayed symptoms unlike those ever seen before, and reanimates those who were previously killed by the virus or by other means. Reanimated victims are extremely violent and should be avoided at all costs. This message is being transmitted on all stations and will be updated when new information is available. H6N9 virus has been named the zombie virus. Personnel in local, state, and national government centers in the United States have succumbed to the virus. This includes emergency responders. With few exceptions, all fire departments, ambulances, hospitals, and police departments are unable to respond to emergencies. Electrical and water utilities around the country are failing. Local utilities will likely fail within hours. Water and food should be stockpiled. This message is being transmitted on all stations and will be updated when new information is available.
countries and governments around the world have fallen, including the United States. Avoid anybody with fever and vomiting at all costs. Avoid reanimated corpses at all costs. Reanimated corpses can only be stopped by damaging the corpse's brains. This message is being transmitted on all stations and will be updated when new information is available. Civilization has fallen. Avoid sick people and reanimated corpses at all costs. Avoid major population centers at all costs. Stockpile food and water. This message is being transmitted on all stations and will likely never be updated again. I want to thank Mike Fulton for putting together the Zombie Weapon Challenge, celebrating the latest season premiere of Walking Dead. Gave me a chance to make the Sling Bolt 6000. Lots of fun. First weapon I've made. Mostly uh, two-by material, and I think I'll probably end up making more, even though my wife doesn't like them. Make sure you check out the rest of the videos on the playlist. It's over right here. And I will see you on the next project, if they don't get you first. Did you like this video? Let me know by sharing it, giving me a thumbs up, subscribing to my channel, and leaving a comment down below. Also, take a few minutes to visit my website, manhattanwoodproject.com, follow me on Facebook, and follow me on Twitter. So kids, how's your zombie? It actually tastes pretty good. Now I know why zombies like this stuff.